Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a user to set up access for Kidsoft. To do this, you can click on your service menu and under configuration, click on user accounts. To be able to create users in Kidsoft, you need to ensure your user role has the user role access user management. To create a new user, on the Users tab, you're going to click here to add a new user. You will enter in the first name and the last name of the user. Enter in the user's email address. This is really important that you use the user's own personal email, as this email address is used for when the I forgot password is used for the user. You can create a password manually for the user. Please remember it needs to have a capital letter, a symbol and a number. If you want the user to have access to iCheckIn, you need to enter in an iCheckIn pin. This is a minimum of seven symbols, so seven numbers. If at all you need to reset the iCheckIn pin for this user, you can click reset pin. If you need to end a user at any time, you can enter in the end date and this will then automatically deactivate the user on that end date. Please note this, no, this field is non-mandatory, so we do recommend leaving this field blank when creating the user account. If you do not want to send the user an email, you can leave it as no in the filter and simply click Save User. If you select Yes, it will send the user an automatic email with their username and password that you have already just created. Alternatively, you can select Yes and include password and it will send an automatic generic password to that user and then they're asked to update it when they first log into Kidsoft. Once you've completed those mandatory fields, you can then click Save User. They will then display in the list. Their username is defaulted automatically based on their first name and last name. For any further information on how to create a user account, please do not hesitate to reach out to the Kidsoft Customer Success Team. You may also like to look at our video tutorials in our YouTube channel for more tips on Kidsoft. Thank you.